Titanic Jelly Cat is coming out in just hours from now, and I'll be showing you guys how to get it. But first, do you want a free huge? Just like the video, subscribe, and comment your Roblox username. Here's the last video's winner. I'm sending them one of my mini golden huge rocks. Let's go. Anyways, the Titanic Jelly Cat. Here is how to get it. I also got a bit more information on some other Titanics that are coming out soon, so it's gonna be pretty crazy about all you guys know about everything. As you know, the current exclusive egg, which is the crystal egg, is going away in 18 hours, so basically the next update, and it is now confirmed that the next egg is gonna be the exclusive jelly egg, so it's gonna be exclusive egg 13. So the jelly pig and tiger are actually gonna be normal exclusives, and also a jelly corgi will be exclusive. The huges, okay, I have leaks of these, the huge jelly corgi and huge jelly pig. Normally, the pigs are rarer in eggs than corgi, so it's probably gonna be like the pig is 0.7%, and the corgi is 1.25%. Then the Titanic is gonna be the 0.05% one, so the new Titanic Jelly Cat is gonna be gotten from the exclusive egg. But, okay, there is another option. There is another option. This is not... No, I said it's confirmed, but I, I don't know why I worded it like It's like 99%. I'm pretty sure it's gonna be the new exclusive egg, because there haven't been any other leaks. Okay, there is the new world. Now, they could just be adding a candy-themed exclusive egg, because the new world is candy themed. It's gonna be in limbo after kawaii world, the new, I don't know exactly what it's gonna be called, I'm pretty sure it's gonna be like candy world, but this is a candy world. There could be the Titanic in an egg, and it's gonna be the first free-to-play Titanic you can hatch. Now, that is just a possibility, like again, pretty sure it is the new exclusive egg, but there is still a chance that it could be in the egg in the candy world. Most eggs don't have that many pets in them though, like these only have four, and since there are leaks, like, two huges and some other pets, and all of them are the same theme, like, okay, usually the same theme pets are in the same egg, so since this is the cafe egg, there are pets that are, like, food themed, and then these eggs just have, like, cute pets, because it's kawaii eggs, so, like, I don't think that they'd put two huges three exclusives, and the Titanic in the same normal egg, so again, probably the exclusive egg, most likely. I don't know what type of pets are gonna be in the candy world, though. There still haven't been any leaks for huges or anything else, really, in the candy world. There are leaks of what's gonna be in the new Cinco de Mayo world, so maybe, maybe the Cinco de Mayo world is gonna have a candy area. Maybe that's just, like, the candy world the whole time. I don't know, though, because the spawning area with Cinco de Mayo stuff has cat has, like, pinatas and the Cinco de Mayo decorations, so, like, I... I don't know if they make a candy world in the Cinco de Mayo world, but here are the leaks. So there is a corgi with the sombrero on it, because this is sombrero corgi, and then the sombrero axolotl. Then here's another picture of them, but these are the icons with the goldens and dark matters. I don't know why there are never leaks of the rainbows. Maybe the rainbows are not like, they don't make icons of them, they just add an effect over it. If the candy world is its own thing, again, the new secret pet there is going to be the best pet in the game, but if it's a uh, I mean, there's probably not gonna be a secret pet in the sombrero area. I mean, there could be, and it'd probably be the new strongest one, but the mythicals are definitely gonna be better than the current mythicals, but pretty much every time that plushies are sent out, like, after people get them, they release a new plushie so that people spend their money again, which is why there are gonna be two new Titanics, because right now, if you look in the index for the Titanic Lucky and Capybara, there are 321 Luckies and 174 Capybaras, so, people are getting them. Luckies came a little faster than the Capybaras, though, and that's why it less exists, but I'm pretty sure there are a thousand of each, so the new Titanics that they're gonna release soon probably will also have a thousand each. But here they are. One of the devs posted them on Twitter and blurred them out, but, I mean, it's still pretty easy to make out what they are. The first one is the Titanic Tie-Dye Dragon, and it looks like it comes with a smaller version of it. Just like the other Titanics, it comes with a smaller version, so it's probably gonna be the same price all also, $250, because they sell, like, all the Titanic plushies for $250, but, bro, I bet, like, the same thing is just gonna happen every time. It literally sells out in a few minutes, and since they're a thousand each of $250, the devs are, once again, making $500,000 in a matter of minutes, which is, like, absolutely crazy. Like, I thought there weren't a thousand when I first started playing PetSimX of things, because it was $250, but it's just insane how fast it sells out. Like, the Capybara sold out in one minute, the Lucky sold 
sold out in three minutes, and before that it was even slower, like both of the Titanic Bloom Cats sold out in like eight minutes. I think I'm one of the few YouTubers that hasn't ever bought a Titanic plushie, like I I would not buy them. I'd trade for them though, like I have ten Titanics, and I didn't buy any of them because um, I just, I don't know, I like trading. Titanics are dropping right now, so I'll probably try to trade for another Titanic today, maybe two Titanics. I don't know how much I can afford with my inventory. I mean, my only really expensive thing is a rainbow huge capybara, and I have a whole bunch of random stuff. I almost forgot about it, but here's the Titanic tie-dye cat. Also, while I was editing, there's another leak. It is the monkey pinata, so I'm pretty sure those are gonna be replacing the pinata cats. So if you open the big pinata in the middle, or like any pinatas and you get the egg, then you're you're gonna get the monkey instead of these, or maybe there is gonna be a whole different thing, like instead of these, they're gonna be monkeys and you like break it and get some cool stuff, but I'm pretty sure it's gonna be a pet, like, cause, I mean, not only does it look like a pet, but there's also a golden version, so yeah, it's probably just gonna replace the pinata cat, if not, it's gonna be like another thing you can get from the secret egg that comes out of the pinatas. But I've still been spending all my diamonds, like whenever I get diamonds, I instantly spend them on like huges, because all huges are pretty much going up. I know some go down and then go up like huge rocks have been all over the place over the past week but diamonds are just going to be easier and easier to get every single update especially when they add stronger pets because stronger pets can break the stuff in the diamond mine faster and yeah it's just going to be easier to get diamonds some other things i should probably mention are like huge lucky and huge cap or not bro i say huge titanic lucky and capybara are going for like a lot more than the balloon titanics and like a lot of other titanics but they're just gonna drop to around the price of balloon cats. Maybe the capybara's not. It's gonna be a little bit higher, but still, like, they are not gonna be worth an insane amount for long, but I'm probably gonna add values to them to tellmethicvalues.com. Make sure you use that for valueless, best valueless. Yeah, but, like, the tie-dye pets are also gonna be somewhere around, well, unless if all titanics go up or down, because, like, all titanics were going up so much, and then they just drop so hard now, like, I don't know, the tie-dye titanics are gonna be going for around, somewhere around the same price as the balloon pets, like the Titanic red and blue balloon cats. Same with the Lucky and Capybara, because a thousand of them exist, but like only a few hundred are in the game right now, so that's why they're going for a bit. By the way, for some reason, I've been seeing a lot of people talking about them finally adding a, like a shadow coin world or something. I don't know why. It's like something to do with the glittering cat that I showed last video. I, I don't think they're doing that, because that was just, uh, I don't know if that was like a testing thing or how they accidentally added that enchant, or exactly what happened. I mean, it's not really that rare. It doesn't make pets worth like an insane amount more, but since it's already a secret thing, there were probably some people that collect stuff with it, and if they did that, it would really ruin the economy. I mean, I don't doubt they'd eventually add a shadow coin thing, because they did already ruin the economy with the diamond mine, and they didn't nerf it for 24 hours after people already got trillions of diamonds, but the new area is most likely gonna use Doodle coins in the Cinco de Mayo event area, 100% is gonna use like, I don't know, sombrero coins or something, I don't know, there are a lot of sombrero pets, so yeah, I have no idea what currency it is gonna be, but there's definitely gonna be a new currency for the new world. I'm probably not gonna trade for any until they drop, because I don't wanna just have it for it to drop more. Anyways, I'm also gonna stream this update, so make sure to subscribe with notifications on, like the video, join this course that are linked in the description, do everything else linked in the description, but thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all in the next video.